G'day all again and, and welcome back to the Facebook page. This week I want to talk to you what I'm referring to as the Brigade Capability Model. And essentially again we're targeting level 5 and 4 brigades and I'll give you an example. So some of our brigades at this level have upwards of 100, 120, 140 members. Each one of those members uh, wanting turnout gear, wanting access to training, wanting access to welfare support and so on and so forth. When we actually have a look at some of those brigades, we've identified that somewhere between 20 and 30 actually turn out on a regular basis. What we want to do is reach an agreement with our level 4 and 5 brigades of exactly how many members that you need to respond. We think the number will vary somewhere between four, uh, 30 and 50 odd numbers and then we'll come up with a commitment that we will agree with each one of those brigades to give you the PPC, the training, uh, the support you need to deliver um, for those 30 to 50 odd members. Now it still means you can have 100, 120 members and some of those will be doing other things if you like. And those that have been around a while understand the old active and reserve model, very similar. There will be a cohort of people within each of these brigades that will focus just on training. And so we can then say, well, how many truck drivers do you need? How many water squirters? How many chainsaw operators? How many pump operators? And then say, how many have you got? Work out the balance if you're still with me. Then I can go to DCO training and say, look, um, we're short of so many train store operators. We're so short of so many truck drivers. Can you run that many truck driver courses for us? Or our, our infrastructure people, this is how many uh, sets of structural gear, this is how many sets of wildfire gear or welfare people and so on and so forth. I think you get the point. Having a capability, what is the capability of each of our level four and five brigades that you need to run fires, um, to go and run operations. And let's really focus on building that quality workforce in those brigades. And we come to some agreement about what that figure is. Again, we've got in the brigade classification a whole heap of other roles that other people can play. Um, but, and, and as positions come up, they can then replace them. We're piloting that at the moment. Uh, we're piloting that in the West region and we're looking to expand that pilot right across the state later in 2018. Watch out for that one. Um, it's a new initiative within the organisation and a step I think we have to take.